day 26, Numbers chapter 2, verse 34. So the Israelites did everything the Lord commanded Moses. That is the way they encamped under their standards, and that is the way they set out, each with his clan and family. Numbers chapter 2, verse 32 to 34, and then Numbers chapter 3 through 26, verse 26. These are the Israelites, counted according to their families. All those in the camps by their divisions number 603,550. The Levites, however, were not counted along with the other Israelites as the Lord commanded Moses. So the Israelites did everything the Lord commanded Moses. This is the way they encamped under their standards, and that is the way they set out, each with his clan and family. This is the account of the family of Aaron and Moses at the time the Lord talked with Moses on Mount Sinai. The names of the sons of Aaron were Nadab, the firstborn, and Abihu, Eleazar, and Ithamar. Those were the names of Aaron's sons, the anointed priests who were ordained to serve as priests. Nadab and Abihu, however, fell dead before the Lord when they made an offering with unauthorized fire before him in the desert of Sinai. They had no sons, so Eleazar and Ithamar served as priests during the, during the lifetime of their father, Aaron. The Lord said to Moses, bring the tribe of Levi and present them to Aaron the priest to assist him. They are to perform duties for him and for the whole community at the tent of meeting by doing the work of the tabernacle. They are to take care of all the furnishings of the tent of meeting, fulfilling the obligations of the Israelites by doing the work of the tabernacle. Give the Levites to Aaron and his sons. They are the Israelites who are to be given wholly to him. Appoint Aaron and his sons to serve as priests. Anyone else who approaches the sanctuary must be put to death. The Lord also said to Moses, I have taken the Levites from among the Israelites in place of the first male offspring of every Israelite woman. The Levites are mine, for all the firstborn are mine. When I struck down all the firstborn in Egypt, I set apart for myself every firstborn in Israel, whether man or animal. They are to be mine. I am the Lord. The Lord said to Moses in the desert of Sinai, count the Levites by their families and clans. Count every male a month old or more. So Moses, continued, so Moses counted them as he was commanded by the word of the Lord. These were the names of the sons of Levi, Gershon, Kohath, and Merari. These were the names of the Gershonite clans, Libni and Shimei, the Kohathite clans, Amram, Izhar, Hebron, and Uziel, the Merarite clans, Mali, and Mushi. These were the Levite clans, according to their families. To Gershon belonged the clans of the Libnites and Shemites. They, the, these were the Gershonite clans. The number of all the males a month old or more who were counted was 7,500. The Gershonite clans were to camp on the west behind the tabernacle. The leader of the families of the Gershonites was Eliasaf, son of Lael. At the tent of meeting, the Gershonites were responsible for the care of the tabernacle and tent, its coverings, the curtain at the entrance to the tent of meeting, the curtains of the courtyard, the curtain at the entrance to the courtyard surrounding the tabernacle and altar and the ropes and everything related to their use.